Hey guys, it's Allie. Welcome back to my channel, Allie Cat TV. Um, we got some guests, so let me introduce ourselves. Brandon, straight out the L, you feel me? Dupree, out of A, ATL stand up. Hello, um, <laughs> what in the world? Sophisticated to you here. Where, where are you dividing from? Don't worry about me. Y'all, <laughs> uh, y'all see the title video. We just, just, just watch the video. Okay. So, first question, guys. What fashion styles don't y'all like on girls? Um, well, I would start with uh, there's something that has blown up the popularity. <laughs> I hate fucking chunks. I hate. I do not Man. like chokers. Hey, hey, chokers. It came from my throat. I don't, like, I don't like chokers. I ain't chokers, but I mean. I don't like chokers. Some people can rock chokers, some people can't. It ain't how I like chokers. So, you send a girl with a choker, she's bad. You're like, oh, I just can't do it. Yeah, you were good. I mean, okay, if you look good, you look good, but yeah. I just rather. Like, we don't work on that. He's right. He's rather give a choker. Okay, um, any other style? <laughs> what about you, Brandon? Yeah. I'm trying to figure I can't even see. Mm -hmm. Literally. I know some people like the steps and piercings, you know, a little bit. What about clothes? You can say you don't like all the ladies. I don't know, I feel like this people can rock different stuff. Yeah. As long as you look good, then you rock it the right way. So it ain't nothing like Tim's or nothing? That you all like me kind of like, uh uh. No, the only thing I don't like, bro, right, is when girls do like the little skinny tight dresses with Jordans. Like, wow. yeah, don't do that. Uh, yeah, if you're gonna do a pencil dress, yeah, yeah, yeah. don't do like, no the Jordans. That's kind of all Sam Put them on some, yeah. Put them Another on thing, them. stop wearing Uggs in 60, 70, 80 degree mm -hmm. weather. Like, Uggs are not for the club. I'm sorry. They're not. <laughs> this is like cost $200. It's not me. Uggs oh, no. in the club. Oh, Holy. <laughs> Outside, and, 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 and it could be like, if it's below, and then if I brush with all the Tim's in the summertime, like, you got the long time. Sweaty ass feet, thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Damn, don't do it. Mean, that's like, what about the flannel? Y'all like flannel? Like, whenever you're wearing a Tim's with the flannel, wrap uh, around their waist? Oh, no, I'm cool with this. Yeah, I'm cool with this. I feel like this is I don't know. I don't know. Maybe my big thing is just, you just gotta know what you can and can't wear. What you mean, what I can and can't wear? Like, certain people try to wear certain stuff. Like, like y'all try to pull off a clothes that like it's not for you. It's like they're like the other tailor be wearing. Like not everybody can do that. That's like <laughs> that's what she wants. Like, mm -hmm. Not everybody can do that. Okay, since we're talking about like styles and stuff, what about hairstyles? What are some hairstyles I don't like? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not against it neither. As long as you don't 
as long as you not take up, if I can rub my finger down your face and just take off the whole whistle, I'm, I'm <laughs> That's I'm the greatest. So, well, how do y'all feel? Do y'all feel like makeup equals like a girl's confidence? Yeah. They go ahead and there. I mean, that is something that personally, like, you have to get to know what you know. Yeah. If that's the reason why, then that's why you do it. I'm just 40 minutes, but like, if you just do it just to be like, I just want to do it, I'm mm-hmm. like, you look just fine. Yeah. Like, yeah. Let it go. Okay. Or do it all like, Cages, like the, yeah, you ain't yeah. It's more like I feel like too much. Yeah, I feel like too much. Feel like they gotta do it all. No. Sometimes you, I mean, yeah. like you said, sometimes you, you look you look good. Sometimes females look better than that than they do without the makeup, and they just they need somebody to tell them really. Look, I'm gonna be like that's natural. I'm like, oh no. Okay, so I mean, this is a scenario it. question. Okay, let's say you talking to this girl, you met online, whatever. You thought she was cool, everything. Find out they had catfish. Versus you were talking to this person that y'all met and like they famous, they're like got a little clout, you know, on Instagram. And when y'all meet up in person at shallow, which person would you like? Would you pick? Like they shallow, like they can see you, like they all they phone all the time, they don't think they're not really like they're smart. They, they, don't they, they aren't the person that bad personality. Which one do you prefer? Yeah, which one? The catfish? Or, or, the, or the person that you oh. knew? You knew this person, you seen them. But and it, they still kind of like lie. So when he met up with them, they like, how bad of the captain is talking? Yeah, cause this, I, the person is still attractive. Oh, they, they just are a little. Uh, but they lie to you the whole time. About they never. They were just dodging to meet you. Like, okay. Yeah, I got to figure out what you're lying about, but right, I, can't, so I, can't, I can't. I can't deal with it. shallow. I can't deal with no shallow. Don't be no nigga behind that catfish. Like that's that's <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe catfish is nigga. Well, of course not. But yeah, no. Nah, if if I can shallow personality, like yeah, you acting real funny and mm-hmm. stuff, I can. And speaking, and speaking of that, what are how y'all feel about like meeting somebody on Instagram nowadays versus meeting somebody in person? Like, what you feel is more genuine, or do you feel like it's in person? Yeah, I but does it downplay the person? Like, if it's nowadays, it's like everybody's like, well, I met my baby on Instagram, you know. Or, how do you feel like? I don't know. I rather, I rather, I like talking. Yeah. Meeting people and talk people in person before I get to talk to them on social media stuff. I think just because you, when you talk to somebody, you can you get a genuine answer every time. That someone might lie mm-hmm. with but you on social media or whatever, you hit somebody up, they can they can wait five ten minutes before they get you back up. You ask if I ask you a question right now, you gotta give me an answer. Okay. And, and if you don't, then I know what's right. up. If you do, I can kind of read you and tell, yeah. okay, if you're lying or not. So I'd rather just try to meet people for the first one. Just kind of see how it is. Okay, okay. So how do y'all feel about approaching a girl in public when she like friends? You know, I feel like friends, oh, well, let me go ahead. My friends know me, that's great, y'all. I don't know. I'm going to be real. I'm yeah, terrified. Yeah. I, I feel like females like to call them front friends, friends, and try to ask. No, that's what I'm going to They try to ask. They just, yeah, man. See, they, I feel like some girls be cock blocking. Like, what about the friend? Like, 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 you at a party, you dance on a girl, and her friend, like, uh uh-uh, uh, and then a girl moves. That's like, true. That's true. Hey, too. I don't put myself in those scenarios, so I don't really know. That's true, too. But, like, I don't go out, so I don't know. Yeah, but, like, but like yeah, as far as trying to approach the females in front of their friends, mm-hmm. I'd rather, mm-hmm. rather try to approach you solo. Because yeah. that's kind of the same thing as, like, social media. You with your friends, like, nah, she might try to act out or whatever because her friends in there. Whether if I'm with you one on one, I might get a whole different response. Yep. And as far as the party thing goes, yes, the yeah, friends do cock block. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wow, well, I don't know. What are some things they do that annoy you? Like, what are some things girls do in a relationship like that annoy you? Like, y'all official. What's a pet peeve? When you are so you know, yeah, like you know, and you don't ask for communication, bro. Like. Y'all assume and then hold it against your man and then when they ask you what's wrong, you be nothing. Something like that. I mean, talk to the talk to the man and be like, what's up? So we can't read your mind. Right, and then communicate. We know. Yeah. Yeah. We know. So, so why can't you though? Rather just to get a communication like you said, don't assume nothing. If you got if if you if there's something on your mind that you think could be going on, don't sit back and let it eat you up and right. you Talk to your friends and stuff, this da 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 da, but you ain't said nothing to me, then all of a sudden I get snapped on and I don't know what the hell is going on. <laughs> Great, you like, I gotta be. Yeah, so I'd rather you just come to me before, like, 
you want anybody to know. Okay, speaking of that, how do, what do y'all feel about girls having guy best friends? Because usually this is the person they're going to go to before they go to you. As long as I know the nigga, I'm straight well. Yeah. Okay. It really, as long as. I feel like they yeah, like that. If I'm straight with him, that's cool. Yeah. 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 And if he was a friend before me, I'm um, yeah. I'm straight. If all of a sudden he don't pop up by the way, that's dead. That's you don't make me best friend. Yeah. That's yeah. when yeah. that's, yeah. that's, yeah. that's my guy problem now. Cause where he come from? Yeah. Right. All of a sudden we you know we we got this going on and he just came out of nowhere. Big problem. How was I feel about? How was I feel about her hanging? You hanging with her guy best friend like late like. They just out like, they go out later last night. Later, yeah. Like, they go out with him, like, maybe they go out and eat, like, they, you know what I mean, like, this is one-on-one. That's her brother. No. You talking about, like, going to the party or something? Yeah. No, no, no. Because, yeah, because either all that means is they go to the party. Either she dance with him, or she dance with somebody else. Right. And he ain't gonna stop. If she dance with him, he ain't gonna stop. If she dance with somebody, he ain't gonna stop from dancing with somebody. So, yeah, nah. Anything nah. Okay. Okay, so how y'all feel about girls who have like a lot of clout, like, like in terms of, you think she might have some hoes. Or like, you look at her right. face and it look like she got a lot going on, like a lot of niggas like it coming. Right, because this is what's gonna turn off me. I know you got some hoes. Like, right. how? I'm not sure I'm asking. I ain't no assumer type person. I don't have to see what it's going. But if you be up front with it, I'm not. I mean, but if you get attention, I mean, there ain't nothing that we can do about it. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, it's, yeah. You might feel that way, but it's like. So that doesn't turn you off when a girl is like. But she's not friendly. So you know, because at the end of the day, she may got a nigga like him up and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, if I come forward and she just. And she, like, we're doing our thing one on one. Like she, she ain't giving no attention. Yeah, but like she giving me attention, it doesn't matter. Yeah, if she ain't giving no attention, she's not going to be frustrated with it. Yeah. Sometimes if you come across, it's just like, got no females have a problem with it. Yeah, I feel like it's reversed. Too much hard. He ain't you up, so I ain't doing that. I ain't giving back up or whatever. Okay, I got a question. So, what if you're dating a girl and y'all know she used to be back in the day too, but out there? How, would you date somebody? Yeah. She got a high body count, let's be honest. Yeah. So, how how was y'all? Like, was she a great person? How? But you know, your dude was like, hey man, ain't this all? What's the high body count to you? Yeah. That's good, <laughs> yeah. What's a, what's a, what's a, what's a body count that's good and what's a body count that's bad? Nine days, I'm gonna say about seven, eight or more. And she's your age, the same age you yeah. yeah. Live the same life that you have. About eight or more. That's high. Seven, eight or more. You said it's high? No, that's regular. But I, I don't know. I probably, I probably have to agree. Yeah. I mean, that's tough, man. The, I mean, the body kind of thing is tough. Yeah. Because I can't. I don't think shit happy yet. Yeah, stuff happy. Ain't nobody going to tell you. But I'm talking about, my question was more about the girl. I'm on school, like, everybody knows. Like, so you know how in Cuba, Lexington is small, but everybody knows this thing when you get around. But she, she not really on it no more. But still, when you hang with the dudes, like, they always bring it up. Like, Man, I hit her back, you know, da, 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 da. Yeah. so and so hit her back, you know, like everybody know about her. It's always somebody, some dude. She's not doing it no more. No, she's trying to. I would get annoyed with them. I would get annoyed with them always. Yeah. I ain't trying to say something, but it is what it is. What did it tell you from a girl? Like, you see, um, you see the new stuff she's doing, and then that's when you hear about all this stuff back in the day. Like, you know, but if you want to, me personally, if you want to change your ways, because like I said, everybody got their past. I'm not going to judge you off your past, so if you got a past, you got a past. Like, we can all work past that at the end of the day. I mean, we all humans, we ain't perfect, so yeah. it's just like, they, people gonna talk. I can't say this yeah, nigga. People gonna talk in general. Yeah. 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 I would probably ask the question, like you said, if you, if you talk to them and all of a sudden you, you hear something, yeah. I was with a curiosity going to spark, so I would ask questions. Yeah, gotta be but I mean, I don't, I don't know if I would just be like, nah, I can't, I can't mess with no more. I gotta, but here it is, if yeah. how I'm feeling, how I'm feeling, we'll figure that out. You gotta be those kind of yeah. Now if you, if I figure this out and you lie, I find you and then that's when it's like, yeah, nah. Is that right? Yeah. Is what you lie for, right? Yeah, exactly. Okay. What things can girls do or say that turn you off like instantly like? I just can't. Like when you first start talking. Like it's a, it's a whole round. Like, I can't do that. You assume and don't, and don't hear me out? 
You assume they come to you with an argument already. You got it made up in your mind, but you ain't trying to hear the truth. But like you can't hear my thought of so like how you know what's really the truth. And then you just go around it. I'm just like, bro, what's the point? If you can't sit here listen to me and talk to me about what's going on with me and not hear my thought of it, or you see something or hear something, and then you can't come to me up front about it and like add me personally, that's dead, bro. Like, what a trust that, what a communication stuff that. Um, one thing probably being extra, extra aggressive as far as like I do this, I fuck you that mm-hmm. all that. I'm I'm a mild man to do Yeah. <laughs> I'm mild man so I'm not you feel me. If you trying to do all that extra talking and trying to heal me and stuff, I, I understand playing stuff like that, but sometimes it I just rather not. So <laughs> That's it. That's all you got anything else? I'm trying to think. Like, like on some like, if I see a girl smoking a cigarette, oh, it's like. Yeah, hard. yeah. Smoke a cigarette. Smoke no cigarette. <laughs> yeah, but I can't, I can't stand smoking smoke, smoke cigarette. What about a girl who is like, way too intoxicated at a party? One time? Or one time. Like, if, if that's right. every, if like, if we go out and every it's time. Like, oh, yeah, like that's your time and I see you just like sloppy drunk like every time and then nah, I can't do that neither. Like, what about like not sloppy drunk? Just she drunk. Just, she's no, just every, like time she, every time she go out? Like, there's no going out sober ever for her. Mm. <laughs> I don't know. That's, cause that's that kind of how. Just, yeah, that's different. Some people yeah. get down that way. Like, yeah. some people feel like they I don't know. If you, can, if you can't go out without being drunk, that is kind of a problem. <laughs> Most times people go out, they go out, you know, and they go you know, they're gonna drink a little right. bit or whatever. Yeah. Like I said, it's different between sloppy. between being yeah, sloppy drunk and drunk. Mm-hmm. You drunk, okay. If you sloppy drunk where you yelling and you can't stand up and you you can barely walk and all that and you doing that every time. Sure. <laughs> every time, yeah, <laughs> nah. So like yeah. Okay, um, what about a girl who's really flirtatious? Like, this is her, her personality is the flirt. How do you feel about that? Like, like, like she on some looking across her at the room, licking her lips type shit. Or like, or she got, and she got, or she got a lot of guy best friends, and they just, this is how we play, like, you know, and I'm a, Nah, I'm, nah, cause that, I'm, I'm, <laughs> you know, mean, I, I, I mean, I've been there. I know how niggas play, and then, yeah, you so think you're playing, you think you're playing, you ain't 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 playing, you well, a lot of people like girls have a lot of guy friends in the gym. I'm going to be real. I feel like that's a lot. Because I like, yeah, I think, I don't know. I don't, I have like females, females that they call a group of friends. As far as like females, they might have like them like three or four girls that they're mm-hmm. always with. Right. And outside of that, yeah. it's guy friends. Because mm-hmm. I feel like females really just don't like to be bothered with a lot, a lot of females. Mm-hmm. So I, I feel like regardless, I feel like females like just going to like, like going to different like girl like some of my friends like birthday parties and mm-hmm. stuff like that. You see, my uh, God, my God, oh, you yeah. like okay, well, where are your female friends at? Right. They, <laughs> you know them. They, you know, just yeah. five of them, four of them. So I feel like females have more guy friends than girlfriends at least now. I don't know females nowadays. Okay, my last question I can just think of is how do y'all feel about um, like when a girl is still friends with her ex, but that like they. They hang out, they sit with, they just friends. But you know, like, he was before you, they was, like, they were really intimate, and, like, they didn't really break up because he cheated, like, they just a break up, you know? I don't know about this. I, personally, for me, I don't want to know nothing about this. I don't, I really don't care. So I'd just rather not hear about them, and y'all cool now, like, okay, yeah, I get y'all exes, but, I mean, something could spark. From like he could come into the family and then look like they cool. Oh, hell no. Nah, yeah, nah. I'm talking about y'all. Oh, yeah. You know, more family than this. Oh, no, I feel you, but yeah, nah. Like, this is me at that point. So, is there anything else, like, girls do overall that just annoy y'all, like, that y'all can think of? That's all the questions I want. Uh, do I have anything else? Yeah, 
doing extra in public. Doing extra in public. I don't like doing extra in public. What do you mean? What do you mean? Like, oh, like just yelling the most. Yelling. If I'm, if I'm, if I'm, if I'm, Boy. If I'm in a place, if they were in a building, <laughs> yes, bro. and you see me, yelling on the this, right this comes in green. You didn't have to yell my name across Shut the building. Off. You didn't have to. Yeah, that's not, 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 not take off in the full spring, but you ain't got mm-hmm. to run over. You ain't got to run over. So, what about just loud females? You know, like loud females? Oh, hell no. You know, I don't. Because I, I don't, cause, uh, I don't know. See, okay. Why would the high school? It's a lot of females everywhere. So I'm kind of young. I mean, I. So yeah. what did you say? So y'all want to have a, a girl who's quiet better than a girl who had an outgoing personality and was like, shit, the life of the party or something? That quiet girl with me is going to bring the party. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. 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 Yeah, that's what